Hey guys, Steven here back with another video and today I'm going to show you how you can easily add a watermark to your photos on Photoshop and more specifically, I'm going to show you how to do this in bulk. Lightroom has a feature where you can do this, but Photoshop actually doesn't. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to hit the thumbs up button and with that being said, let's get straight into it. So the first thing you want to do is you actually want to download a plugin. You want to go to plugins, you want to go to browse plugins and you want to find this Photoshop plugin called Watermark 3 by Thomas Zagler. It's completely free. Once you're done that, you want to go to plugins and you want to select that plugin. And here you can see some options. So you can do this for a single image or multiple images. So single image is going to edit the photo that you have open right here. You can set a text watermark or a logo watermark. I'm just going to do text all right now. Just choose some random fonts. You can also add a stroke, which is like a border for the text. And then you can select the size and position. So the bottom right, bottom left, top right, top left. And the additional features like choosing presets or resizing and sharpening are available for the pro version, but you don't really need it anyway. So you just want to press add watermark and you can see in the bottom right, it has a watermark. So instead of opening up a photo in Photoshop, you want to go to multiple images. You want to go to source. You want to press source folder. And right here, I have a folder open with about eight photos. You want to press select folder. And then target folder is basically where you want these photos to be exported. I'm fine with it being exported in the same folder, um, but I'm just gonna make a new one. Final. And then select folder. And similar to the single photo, you can adjust the position. I'm gonna do top right and I'm gonna make it medium this time instead. And then you can also choose the export setting. So I'm gonna do 12 quality and JPEG. So I'm gonna press run batch. And you can see it actually opens each photo, adds the watermark sort of by itself. It's like a script. And you can see it's three out of eight, four out of eight. And you can just leave this in the background. So it says batch run successfully. So I'm going to go to my folder. So right here, final folder, and I'm going to open them up. So you can see in the top right of each of these photos, there is a watermark. So yeah, that's about it for this video. I thought I'd make this tutorial because not a lot of people know this. And yeah, if you guys enjoy, make sure to hit the thumbs up button and make sure to check out my Discord channel in the pinned comment if you want to connect with over 600 different creators. And yeah, my name is Steven and I'll see you in the next one.